Hello everybody, today we are going to talk how new generations use technology. But before we start, let's go back to the previous lesson. Here there is a list of some new vocabulary. Do you know what these words mean? Here it says chef, disadvantage, obesity, enthusiasm, determination, to persuade, to encourage, and organic food. But before we start, I listed all these words here, and I really suggest that you copy first all the words, then go to this page. Why? Because this is one of the best online translators, and I'll show you why. If you type a word here, then what you get? You get not only one definition, but a few. So for a chef, you can listen to the pronunciation. Okay, I have to turn on the volume first. So let's hear it. Chef. Okay, then you have a list of translations. And not, not only that, if you scroll down, then you get on the left-hand side uh, the usages in sentences and in English, and the same thing on your right side in Croatian. So you can, uh, uh, from the point of the context, uh, see what fits your translation. So please use this tool, and after copying all these words here, write the translation that you found on glosby.com. Then go back, open your book, page 117, and try to fill the blank spaces. How do you do that? Uh, we'll take a look at number one. What does a chef do for a living? Then you choose from design clothes, organize weddings, and cook, and just circle the right expression. So you have multiple choice, A, B, or C. Once again, copy, find translation, and write it into your notebook. Okay, now it's time for a new topic, the new teen generation and the usage of gadgets. The question is, are you addicted to technology? What you have to do is to open your books and tick the answers that are true for you. If there are more yes than no answers, you might be a tech addict. I'll test it for myself. I spend at least two hours on the, on the internet every day. Well, yes, so there is one yes. I spend most of my pocket money on topping up my mobile phone. No, this is not correct for me. It is cool to have a blog. Yes, I think yes. The best birthday present is a brand new gadget. Well, no. I don't buy CDs or go to the cinema because I download everything from the internet. Completely untrue for me. I adore cinema. I mostly use Facebook to communicate with my friends. Well, yes, but this is an old book, so I suppose that you use some other channels to communicate with your friends, like Instagram and so. It's more fun playing computer games than going out on Saturday night. I don't play computer games at all iPods are much better than in three players. What are they? I don't know. So three S's. I'm not a tech addict. Okay. Now, if you go on, then you will find exercise B and also some new words here. All these words have something to do with technology. The words are cyberspace, MP3 player, texting, an iPod online, Wikipedia, virus to download, YouTube, Website, Gigabyte, Password, Hacker, Twitter, Blogger, Tablet, a Gadget, Facebook, Laptop, and a Smartphone. What you have to do is open your notebooks and draw a table like this. Computers, music, mobile phones, internet. Go back and sort these words into the table. For example, use Wikipedia, take it, and where should you put it? Under computers? Well, no. Music? No. Mobile phones? No. And internet? So it should be put here. Okay. 
Now, the next exercise deals with expressions. Measure the following words from boxes A and B to get phrases from the text. So, in A column, you have to top up, to facilitate, free, long-lasting, to share, and harmful. In B, their matches. So, for example, to top up, I should put a mobile phone. Then, what you have to do is to copy the whole expression into your notebook and translate. Znači, vaša zadača je što da nakon što spojite A izraze s B riječima, znači, kada pronađete izraz koji je uh, smislen, na primjer, to top up a mobile phone, prepišete ga na engleskom i napišete njegov prijevod. Na primjer, to top up a mobile phone, uh, nadokupiti internet podatke. Okay? Homework reminder, slide 3, vocabulary notebook. This is slide 3. This, ovo je znači prva domaća zadaća. Prijepis, pronađemo, napišemo prijevod. Slide 6, table notebook, tablica. I 7, prepisati izraze i prepi, e, napisati prijevod u bilježnicu. Imate rok do ponedjeljka, budući da e, ovaj tjedan se bavite projektnim istraživanjem. Bye, see you.